Hi, and welcome to Inglés en Ueo. In this video, we're going to learn about the object of a sentence. In English, there are two types of objects. Direct objects and indirect objects. A direct object identifies the receiver of a verb's action. For example, Anna. In the sentence, Kevin loves Anna. Anna receives Kevin's love. Here is a trick that will help you find the direct object of a sentence. First, find the main verb and the subject. In the sentence, the dogs eat dog food. Eat is the verb and dogs is the subject. Click here to review how to identify the subject of a sentence or verbs. Now, using whom or what, form a question with the helping verb do. What do dogs eat? The answer to the question will be the direct object. Dog food. Now, let's look at a more complicated example. Anna loves eating popcorn at the cinema. The main verb in this sentence is loves, and the subject is Anna. What does Anna love? The direct object. Eating popcorn at the cinema. An indirect object identifies to whom or for whom an action is done. Take the sentence, Anna gives the dog food to her dog. First, we can find the direct object. What does Anna give? The dog food is the direct object. Now that we have the direct object, we can form another question using to whom or for whom. The helping verb do, the subject, the main verb, and the direct object. To whom does Anna give the dog food? The answer to our question is the indirect object, her dog. Let's look at a more complicated example. Anna told Kevin a lie. First, let's find the subject, Anna, and the verb, told. What did Anna tell? A lie. A lie is the direct object. Now, let's form the second question with to whom. To whom did Anna tell a lie? To Kevin. Kevin is the indirect object of the sentence. Thanks for watching. Si te ha costado entender en inglés, haz clic aquí para ver el mismo video, pero en español. Or, continue with a grammar video on verbs or subjects. Even better, learn English with a movie by clicking here.